Right, welcome now to another golf video. Today, we've got a challenge. This is a belter, all about cheap and expensive. I've got eBay Pete. And he's also got expensive clubs against. This box set was $200 for everything, less than 190 pounds. That's driver, woods, iron, sand wedge, putter, and the bag. Now, Pete's clubs, are you ready for this? They were over £2,000 new. So this is a great challenge of very cheap clubs be very expensive clubs and this is going to be a free all match head to head more importantly done by a normal golfer right so pete's bags there seven wood we've not got but hopefully the iron bread will go mm. for it anyway 390 yard par four peter stay there and that's your old tailor-made m2 isn't it that's the m2 and uh, I don't know how you say it, Pete. That was a Kirkling premium ball. It was. And uh, that got absolutely mullered, didn't it? It did. Now you've got the Slazenger V100. And I, all I'm going to say, these probably are the worst golf balls in golf. Right, well, we'll soon find out. That's my opinion of yeah. using them this morning. What do you think of the driver? Ten and a half degree. Looks all right, mate. Same degree as mine as well, so. Oh, and they're both regular. Yeah. No, it's got a little draw, but I don't think that is not. But it's running forever. No, so it's running all right, isn't it? I tell you what, I can't wait. Get up there. Tell Maybe me what you think. It wasn't it that bad. Well, in the middle. That had a real dead sound to it, though. I think that's titanium. But yeah. I, I can honestly say it. That ball's horrific. Yeah. yeah so it felt dead. <laughs> Did it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so let's go with the slashings again. Fifteen, about twenty yards in them balls, aren't they? That's what we let's think. See. So Pete's got two hundred and ten yard. To the pin the pin's right at back yeah. it's 15 degree he wouldn't normally go for it but he said he's having a go because he wants to hit it so this is the three wood i think this club's not bad not bad it didn't sound great i'll be in the bunker that's i think i think i might have tickled over yeah it might have done was that a good hit it wasn't bad that's no wrong just, with that. just, just off center yeah so it's not no wrong with that at all yeah shot pete not bad still felt dead <laughs> right, it's got 190, so 21 yards. Oh, Jesus. 21, this is your Callaway 3 wood, it isn't is. it? It just sounded better, that. Is that right side of the bunker, Joe? I've seen a bounce. That only just got over the ditch then. Yeah. But There's a difference in sound in the oh, course. Yeah, just, I think the Slazingers are like titanium, yeah. and these are probably yeah. a bit you more. Can feel, you can feel the club off this, but off that, it's like a. Do you think that's the club or the shaft? I think it's the. The face? The face, yeah, definitely. So we've got a sand wedge. Would you always hit a sand wedge? Yeah, from here, because I've gone over the bunker. Okay. If I wasn't going over the bunker, I wouldn't. Pete's Callaway, he's there. It's actually just short of the bunker and close to the water. Yeah. So, here we go, Slazingers. Hey, this is all right. Has that checked up, Joe? I, I couldn't see it from here to save the suit. <laughs> so, but that was all right, actually, yeah. yeah. that was a good shot, that, wasn't, wasn't it? What did you, you first feel at Irons? Well, I didn't actually take it dead clean because I had, a, had quite a bit of muck on it as well. <laughs> right, Pete, this is your glide. You've got three wedges, haven't you? 56, yeah. 52 and 60. Yeah. He's no messing with Pete. And that's the 56. Yeah. No messing here with Pete, is it, eh? Yeah, is it? Pete, I'm not being funny. Yes, I think the, the Slazinger's in there, isn't it? I think this is closer, your Slazinger. Yeah. I think we better go with mine then first. Yep. So Pete's a two ball odyssey. Yeah. No, pull we'll that. I'll give you that. That's a bogey. Oh no, this is an old blade. This one. is heavy as well. Is it? Got heavy head. I never noticed it'd be heavy when I had a go. Mm. Right, for the cheap clubs. Ooh. Good putt. Well, same uh, result, isn't it? One over, one over. What I would say. What did you notice on one all? The fairway woods, or oh, and the driver in the fairway woods were like a dull, dull sound when you hit them. You know what I mean? Right, so okay. there's no, no go in them. One thirty, par three, seven iron in the Wilson, and his premium ball. And we've got seven iron and ugh, the horrible noise <laughs> of the ball. Great golf shot. Is it? Dr oh, zoom in on this, Joyce, holding the pin. Woo. Wow. That Thank you. is called a sighter. It sounded nice, that actually, didn't it? It did. Wow. Oh, wow. Has it got the same length, though? About the same, aren't they? 
I don't, but uh, golf mates, <laughs> come here. That is his handicap there. He is not off plus one. He really is a 15 handicapper, aren't you? Thank you, sir. Yes, I am. Them shots were off a five handicapper. They were. Wow. Well, last time you'll see them this year. <laughs> <laughs> Felt all right, that one. Yeah. Yeah? The hands don't feel bad. Right, as you can see, Liam's just doing the pitch mark from the Kirkland which has landed there. That's the Slazinger with the cheaper club up there, but hit the downslope on this bank here in the back of the bunker, and that's just sped it right on. There's no pitch mark for that ball. But two good shots, won't yeah. there? I'll be happy with them, and I'm off seven. Put him for a birdie, Pete. And this will be a good two putt. Now, a little bit down, he'll pass the flag. Let's give it a whack. He made a funny noise, that, but I think this is looking good. This is, look oh, no, it's going to go fast now here. Yeah, we said it. But a long way, so it's still a good putt, that, wasn't it? Yeah, it's, uh, I just can't get the alignment on it. This is with the expensive ball and clubs. Right to left a little bit. Just needed it in, it was in, wasn't it? Yep, take that away, good par. Yeah. Right, Pete, no pressure, but this is like the underdogs. Everyone's willing, Jesus, this is a low putter, this. Oh! No, I just, I just can't get it lined up. What well, we're saying me. about the noise, listen to this. Yeah, you could hear that, couldn't you? Hit that, hit yours first. Here we go, so you can hear. That's a Kirkland. Yeah. That was quite soft, wasn't it? Oh, it's horrible, isn't it? Yeah, it's just like <laughs> dink. Snap. As the test goes, the expensive clubs are one shot better. M2 in the Kirkland again. One par, one bogey. And I'm trying to line up better because I've been getting comments. That's okay, just fair. I don't think that's your best hit, Pete. No, but it's not bad. To be fair, where the pin is, which is on the left-hand side, right-hand side of the fairway is good. But I thought that it's was this. an okay hit. It weren't as good as the first, as one. The first yeah. drive. Correct. Because last time there were 21 yards in it. Yeah. Same, but that's got no, a great I'll tell you what, that's Is gone. that at the tour, that? That's gone a bit, I think. I think that's going to outdo the Kirkland. Was that at the tour? I've got no idea where that came out of. The was it? The oh, about the tour. Yeah, it didn't right know that. Oh, yeah. That's your first one. Yeah, that's the second, second one. The tour, so that's, but that's where they reckon hits them for distance. Yeah, it's bolt. Seems to have gone, doesn't it? Hey, let's see. Well, the one way to find out. Yeah. Right, so here we are. So this is Peak's expensive clubs and balls, but the other at the tour is pitched 20 yards down there and it's ran all the way. So you've got your pin glide. Yes. You've got your 50 60 degree. I have. We think you've got what, 45 yards? Something like that, yeah. Give it a bash. Middle at green, safe. Now the terminology there. So if you're new to golf and your terminology is just give it a bash, what does that mean? <laughs> well, just don't worry about it, just hit it. There you go, just give it a bash. If you're struggling with your golf, just give it a bash. <laughs> right, we're on the sand wedge on the uh, Slazinger. And this is the cheaper ball and the cheaper club. That heavy. That was me, that. I mean, you're on the dance it's still floor. On. You're on the dance floor, it's still a little on. bit heavy. That wasn't the club, that was the player. So, Pete, you were saying that it doesn't matter what club, you could have had the world's most expensive club. You said you were a little bit heavy. Oh, yeah, but I did I hit behind the ball. So, so it doesn't matter yeah. what club you got. No, no, not so. Okay, okay. So, yeah. it's going to be a put off. Don't forget, the expensive clubs are one shot better than the cheap clubs. Right, Pete, birdie putt. The cheap putter. I hope this gets up there. Oh, it makes a horrible noise. It's a good putt, this. Get in, get in, get in. Sit, sit. Not bad, though. Small bit of life in that. Not bad. It's just a noise, isn't it? Yeah. I, I'm going to say, I don't think it's the face of the putter. I believe it's the ball. It more likely is, Liam, to tell the truth. Oh, it's a, you can have that, Pete. Thank you very much. Oh, that was a good line, but didn't hit it again. Right, Pete, going to ask you. Cheap woods, would you use them? No. Cheap irons, would you use them? Yes, I would actually. Cheap putter? No. Cheap golf ball? The worst golf ball I've ever played with. I I'll think. be the judge to that. We'll do that video. Anyway, golf makes some videos, so make sure you watch them, like and subscribe, and comment below. What clubs have you got?